Hello everyone, what is going on and welcome back to my channel for another video today. Now, I'm bringing you a slightly different video today, it's going to be a stats video because if you don't know or you don't follow me on Twitter, I suggest you do that, my at is Juggernaut, same as my YouTube. I basically tweeted out last night that I finally hit Master Prestige. Now, I've never hit Master Prestige in the game so quickly, I think I hit it on BO3 at about maybe, I'll say around March or somewhere like that, I think, and then I hit Master Prestige and I W it around January. I've never really grinded out a game so much at the start as Black Ops 4. So I thought I'd bring you my stats, leaderboard positions, well as much as I can using that COD Tracker app because I haven't actually put them in the game yet. But as much as I can uh, now just so you, if any of you are interested in what my stats and stuff are. So without further ado let's get into it. Now if you look towards the right side of your screen that's basically where everything is. Uh, win loss is a 3.9 now it was a lot higher but I started to play the solo playlist a lot more which obviously if you're playing solo you are going to lose a lot of games. Now, that's just the way it is. I'm not really bothered about win-loss because this game always throws you into late games where enemy teams have got choppers, strike teams, freshers, all that stuff. But I just end up leaving them games because I'm not going to sit through 120 points of a hard point game when we've got full streaks or what I didn't even, what we didn't even get on me. Now, I've got uh, 39,771 enemies killed in action, but that is with assists as well. And I think on that COD track app, I've got around 31,000 actual kills. With 11,207 deaths, which um, like contributes to a 3.55 EKIA death ratio, and I think about a 2.9 actual KD. Now, I'm pretty happy with a 3.55 EKIA D because I was told countless times, like literally, hundreds of times like I'm a jetpacker and I ain't gonna do anything on a boots on ground game so to come onto a boots on ground game what's fun like World War 2 was just a flop we'll just not even combat as a Call of Duty game so to come onto a boots on ground game what is a fun game what is w more well made than World War 2 with as much of the problems of this game does have it it is reasonably well made to come on and just have a straight 3.5 plus KD, I was like, yeah, who's the fucking jetpacker now? I've been criticised so damn much about how Jackie can only play jetpack games. When a Brutes on Ground game comes out, you'll be nothing. You'll, your channel will die, you won't be able to upload anything because you can't get anything because you're a jetpacker. Whoever are them people who say I'm a jetpacker, fuck you. Um, now, I have 34.4 EKIA per game, which is a bit low, but I did play a little bit of TDM while going for like camos for different weapons i mean i haven't got dark matter yet but i, I am probably going to go for it and ttm is just a really slow mode of this game it's not like it was an iw um 22,900 direct action kills which that basically means how many how many times you put all the damage into an enemy like the full 150 which is not that bad 10 percent headshot ratio which is pretty decent and my highest kill streak is a 47. Now I have 4.74 million score, 515 score per minute, which is just pretty average considering I've just hit Master Prestige. And I don't I don't really think anybody's bothered about the healing per game stuff. Now medals, I have one ultra kill yet to get a kill chain because kill chains on this game are extremely hard. 21 nuclears and I think without like but strike team used to count before. I think without strike team, I think I have about 10 nucleus, which is not that bad to be honest, considering you know I'm a jetpacker. 38 quad feeds, because yet again on this game, quad feeds are difficult unless you're playing hardcore because of the time to kill on this game being slightly longer than others. 44 brutals, because I'm an absolute choke king. And 82 unstoppables, which is honestly, it's not that bad. Uh, I don't really play hardcore, hence the low one shot, one kills. Um, there's not much there, to be honest, apart from. Um, apart from the nucleus and stuff like that. Uh, for score streaks, I don't know why it isn't counting some of my uh, kills with score streaks because I did use a lot of score streaks on this. Oh, there we go. Um, I, know it's, I, don't, I don't know what these leaderboards are doing, but I did use a lot of strike team and attack trouble when I'm playing solo. But when I'm in parties, I'll just run, I think, UAV and counter UAV or something like that. Now, what I'll actually do is I'll just run through some of the classes that I used to use while the most the classes I mostly use while getting up to Master Prestige. So, if there's anything like you would like to try, just please um, let me know. But for the most part, I'll show you everything what I used. Oh, like, there's some good guns on this game, a lot of good guns, but I won't showcase. But these are the weapons I use personally to get up to um, Master Prestige. So, thank, I don't want to really drag the video on so, too long, so I'll just quickly flick through them. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for, for the continuous support. I'll be back to putting up games. 
gameplay is now I'm done with grinding the game up to master. Uh, so expect more of that in the future. Now, thank you so much for watching. I will leave you with the rest of the class videos and some music in the background. And peace.